all right guys welcome back to another video and like always make sure to like share comment and subscribe and today what i'm going to be working on is on my brother's um moped this is his motor that i had got him the other time but the other time we tried to turn it on it didn't work out so what we're doing is um but what i'm going to be doing because my brother ain't here nothing no one's here to record and i'm just gonna disassemble it and see what's wrong with it because every time it turns over it has a like it stops i don't know if my brother put the timing chain on good or what's going on but that's what it feel it feels like i don't know what's going on i'm gonna take it all apart and then i'll come back and show you guys the progress all right guys i'm taking off the rocket arm It feels like the piston's hitting with the head on top. That's what it feels like to me. But it's weird though. No, 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 Mm -hmm. Yeah, because my brother was the one that built this motor, and he never built motors before. No, sir, you got it. Okay, they don't see. Because right, that tensioner goes to the chain right here. And at this tension. So now it's easier to take this off. No sé, ya que me puso el espalda más largo. No sé, you will take care of it. Hold on, we're gonna know what was going on. All right, guys, let me take this rocker on and I'll be back with you guys. All right, guys, I got the motor all back up together. I put the timing on good, and now it ain't stuck no more. The problem with it was the... Where's it at? Um, let me see. Okay, right here, this. Well, not this one. That's the 50 cc. My brother had put an aftermarket camshaft, and the camshaft the load was too big, so it was it wasn't um it was keeping the 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 the, the valve open, and the piston would hit the 
the the valve. That's why it was staying stuck. But now it spins. Got a little compression right there. But it spins freely all the way around. Compression right there again. Right there again. Boom. That's it. So that's done. Now what I'm gonna go do is see if I could come over here and put the motor on. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put it on so I could, I don't know. I was thinking about welding all this right now, but I'm gonna take all this off. I'm gonna do all this shit right now fast. Cause the only cables I need to turn this on is they're already right here. I separated them. I'm gonna cut all these cables out, make this a little cleaner. And yeah, let me put the motor back on and I'll come back with you guys. All right guys, I'm gonna give you guys an update. I already cleaned the carburetor, put the carburetor on, the gas, everything, the mufflers on, everything's on. The only thing we got left was this bracket right here that, I don't know, we had to take it off like this. this it's not supposed to come out like this. It's supposed to come out with the bearing, but the bearing stayed in there because this bracket, somebody broke it. Well, cut it off right there and over here. So we're trying to put a new bracket on there because that's like a support for the motor too in the front. So... What we're doing now is trying to take this um, ball bearing out. And then after that, we take that out. We're going to put the new bracket on. And then I should be good to put the motor back on the um, bike. The but yeah, guys, let's take the, um, let me take this off with my grandfather. And then we, I'll come back and show you guys the progress. We've been on this shit for like an hour already trying to take this off. This is what's been, we stuck on this right now, but yeah, we'll get to you. All right, guys, as you see, we took out the back rim right now, and the whole front end is fucking apart now, because when we went to start it, um, it had no compression, so I was like, damn, my brother was saying it was the piston rings, and then my grandfather too, so I was like, you know what, just take all this apart, and now, y la vieja. Tu la tienes? No, si yo tengo la nueva. Like oh, look at this. Look how straight this one is. The valve. And then look at that. Look at the difference. Crazy. But yeah, now we're going to put this valve on. And I'm going to put all this back together. And I'll bring you guys back with the finished product. Alright, guys. I finished assembling the motor. And now I'm about to put the motor on the bike now. Uh, let me see how I'm gonna do this by myself. But um here's this screw. I think if I can do this.
All right, now I gotta put the tire on, I'm gonna put the shock on and assemble it and we come back. All right, I got the motor on and everything, finally. And I think it does it anymore. Hey, something's going on. Alright guys, thanks for watching and out of luck again, we cannot turn the fucking motorcycle on for the second video. I don't know what it is, but it don't want to know. Now we put the um, valve in and now it got compression. It's it's like doing something to start, but it's not starting. But um yeah. Alright guys, thanks for watching.